MetaTrade 4 login problem is a result of wrong login details like wrong account ID, wrong password or wrong server. To fix the MetaTrade 4 login problem, check your login details and try to log in again. How do you log in to your MT4 account? To log into your Forex trading platform account, you need to use MT4 login details and not your broker account details. This means that there is a difference between MT4 account details and broker account dashboard login details. MetaTrader 4 login details are account ID, which is a set of numbers that define your account on the broker server. Then account password, it is a password randomly generated by the broker server. And after first login into MetaTrader 4, you can change this password to some other you will use. And third is account server. This is defined by the broker server, so you cannot change it. It can be server for demo account or for a real account. On the other hand, there is a broker account. If you want to log in into your account admin dashboard, where you have an account with your broker, then you would use other credentials to enter in your account. Broker account dashboard the details are username, most of the time it is your email you have provided when registering. Sometimes you can get login username which is equal to some numbers which you need to use to login into admin dashboard. Then you have a password. When registering with the broker you define which password you will use to access your admin dashboard. Now let's check the MetaTrader 4 login password. When you register your account Will it be demo account or live account, you will receive a message with account details. Inside that message, you will have an account password you need to enter when you want to log in into trading account. Here is an example of a message with account details. The message contains login account ID, password and investor password. The image shows you an example of a demo account on MT4 I have registered for trading. The account has been registered with MetaQuote server, which is free, and you can open as many accounts as you want. The message is inside the mailbox tab in the MT4 platform, so you can always look there for the message. In the mailbox below, you can see that there is a message with a new account registration. When you open that message with double click, you get the login details. New account reg registration has a login account ID, password and investor password. So for this trading account, you can see here it is completely the same. These are the login data. Broker account message is a message when you register a demo account with your broker and you get account details on your email. Broker sends you a password with account ID and server name. You can see that in a case when your broker sends you account details, you get more details and that is one more detail, which is server name. This example has different account details because this message was sent from a broker with their account. Here is a message that I have received from my broker when I have registered demo account. Now you can see here, this is the demo trading account login details. This email contains the trading platform I have registered account on, then there is login account ID, this is the password and this is the server I should use when I try to log in to this broker server. So there are two options. You can use this broker MT4 platform or you can use MetaQuotes login, uh, MetaQuotes trading platform and find this server and connect with these login details. In this case, I will show you how to do that with this MetaQuotes. So I will take this server go here, then login to trade account, sorry, open an account, then I will find this broker server, I'll put it here, just a minute, so I see market, I see demo 2, I will search for it, oh, here it is, next, existing existing trade account i will put the login data here login is this and the password is this finish 
Now you can see here I have connected successfully with IC Markets demo account with this data and I can trade right now. So if there is a problem with the login to trade account, for example, I change the login password, I will get no connection and invalid account because the IC Markets broker doesn't recognize this trading account with this login password. So I'll fix this with the correct password and in a few seconds this trading platform will connect to the demo account. You can see it here. The connection status in green. Then we have MetaTrader 4 login account ID. Account ID is a number that defines your account among all other accounts on the server. If you do not enter the correct account ID, you will experience MetaTrader logging problems. Account ID is a number and rarely or almost never a combination of numbers and letters. Up to now I have never seen an account ID with letters. It was always with numbers. Account ID is usually the smallest issue when you want to log in into trading platform, because the account ID is a number which you can simply copy paste without making a mistake. So why does your MetaTrader 4 say invalid account? If you enter wrong account ID, you will see a message invalid account. That message will be in the top bottom right corner where the signal strength is shown. The only thing I have entered incorrectly was my account ID. So that is the reason why I got invalid account message because the trading platform and server recognize that account is not valid. Then we have a MetaTrader 4 server. When you receive a message with logging details, you get information which server you should use. If you have registered a new trading account over a MetaQuotes MT4, then you will use MetaQuotes server. But if you have registered a trading account with another broker, then you need to use their server. The server name is inside the email as I have shown you in the previous image. Then you need to find the server in the list of available servers and select the one you need. Second option is to manually enter the name of the server in the field where the server is written. If you enter the wrong server name, you will get the message no connection. That message appears when you do not have access to the data from the broker server. And when you enter the wrong server name, you cannot connect to the broker server, which makes sense that you do not have access to the broker server data. Sometimes you will see a common error on the MetaTrader 4. A common error is a message you get when there is no connection with the broker server. As I have explained a few lines before, the server connection is needed to have data feed from the broker server. If that happens, you will get common errors which can be fixed easily. To fix common errors, simply provide an internet connection so the trading platform can get the data from the server and send requests to the server. Now here is an example in the MetaTrader 4 about when you are using MetaQuotes demo account and what happens when you have a wrong password or wrong account ID. When you are logging into an account, you can log in with the data that you have received from the MetaQuotes when you register a new demo account. So here is the login data and here is the password and here is the server that I'm currently using. Because I'm using MetaQuotes demo account, I'm using their MetaQuotes demo server. So after you click the login, the MetaTrader 4 will connect here, what you can see, connection status. It has the speed and when you, when you click on it, you get also the access points that you currently have. Then what happens when you connect with the wrong account ID and what you can see here it is the login account ID, which is only the numbers. So if I make a mistake and remove the last number from the account ID, I will try to log in. And what you can see, there is no connection. The problem is that there is no connection because the account ID on the MetaQuote server doesn't exist with this password. So I need to fix this problem and log in with the correct ID. So when I fix this error and put a zero at the end, which is the correct account ID, the MetaTrader 4 will connect correctly. In a few seconds, you will see here, everything is okay. 
it is a green green bars with the speed so what happens when you register a new account so if I copy paste and try to log in with this login data everything will be just fine the MetaTrader 4 trading platform will connect easily but what happens if I make a mistake and remove the last letter from the password and try to log in I will again get the same problem there is no connection invalid, invalid account now you can see that the MetaTrader 4 in this case meta quotes demo server says there is no this account with this password so it is invalid account to fix that I need to log in with correct password I have copy pasted the password and I will log in now after a few seconds no connection and then the trading platform will connect the connection status is in green and there is a speed if you are using MetaTrader 4 on your mobile then you will see authorization failed problem that means that you have wrong password or account ID to connect with the trading platform broker server responds with a message that the account login data is wrong MetaTrader 4 authorization failed error that appears on mobile phones smartphones or tablets to fix MetaTrader authorization error, check the account ID you are using. Then check the password and check the server. Be careful with passwords, because it happens that you change the initial password to one you will use and later you forget you have changed it. If that happens, you will need to open a new demo account if you are using MetaQuotes MD4 and their demo account. If you are using a broker account, then in the admin dashboard you can reset the password or open a new account. MetaTrader 4 mobile authorization error happened to me when I entered the wrong password. That means the platform could not verify my account and password on the server I have selected as a valid parameter. To fix the authorization error on mobile phones you need to enter the correct account ID and password. And with the correct server. Same error happened when I entered the wrong account ID. I have removed the last number from the account ID and I have tried to connect. But I could not connect. I got the authorization message. Now there is another option and that is MetaTrader 5 web login. If you are using the MT4 or 5 web platform, then the same problem can happen if you make the same mistake. To connect on MT4 or 5 web platform, you need to have an account registered. You can have a free one with the MetaQuote server. After registration you will get an account ID and a password. That is all what you need because on the web trader from the MetaQuotes you are using the MetaQuotes server. In the image I have changed the password and tried to connect. But because of the wrong password I got a login error that I have, a, that I have invalid account or password. It does not state precisely what is causing the problem. Is it account ID or password? If you put the correct password and make a mistake with account ID, you will get the same message. So have in mind that you need to check both data you have entered. Account ID and password must be correct to enter into, uh, into the MT4 web platform. You can access that by logging to WebTrader. Now you can see here, this is the trading account. Now I will create another account. Web terminal. I will click here. Trading account and open demo account. I will open here. Test, test. I'll put here admin at gmail.com hedging okay okay and I agree so here is open demo account here is the data I will save this data so I can log in okay this is it okay okay now here is the login data and the password 
I will get started with this account. Then I will try to log in to the trading account. Here is the data. I will change the last number, remove it and connect to an account. And let, let's see what happens. I get invalid account or password. Logging problem and I need to solve this. I will connect again with the correct login account ID and everything will be fine. Now when I change the password you will see that I get the same error message. So there is a problem with this message which is which shows you that there is an invalid account or password. It doesn't recognize that there is a problem with the account ID or password. You need to check both of them to solve the problem. And I will now put the correct password and connect to the trading platform. And this is OK. That is all from this lesson. I hope you have enjoyed. See you next time and happy trading.